After 70 years of independence, I thought to myself, what does it mean to be an Israeli? It starts with opening your door to others. My daughter is Israeli. Her grandmother was born in Israel. Her granddad is from Poland. Her nana is from Morocco. And Pops was born in Argentina. Hey, what can I say? We are a melting pot of culture and identity. Being Israeli means getting asked, what do you want to do after high school? After your gap year or uni? When will you settle down? Why don't you have kids? Why just one? Don't you want three? It means getting asked these questions from your mom, your gran, your boss, and even from your cab driver. To be an Israeli means being certain your kid is the next Messi, but unable to comprehend why the coach didn't put him in the game. It means schlopping after your family on a hiking trip with your dad proclaiming... To be an Israeli means to proudly sing to yourself in the car, while stuck in the same traffic jam every year on your way to the holiday meal. Being Israeli means celebrating Puri, Christmas, Novigod, Ramadan, Passover, Mimuna. It means preparing Moroccan couscous, Hungarian goulash, Yemenite oxtail soup, and Polish gefilte fish with a side of Israeli salad. And then sitting down with the whole family for a Friday night meal. It also means hearing... And then... And then at the end of the dinner, getting endless leftovers to take home. Being Israeli means hearing, I have an idea for a startup, from every single person you meet. It means everyone is family. And not waiting in line, ever. To be an Israeli means being addicted to the news. Terrified of spoilers. Coming to every party at your kid's kindergarten, but forgetting you're on the decoration committee. It's being proud of every Israeli success abroad. Wonder Woman, Echad. And always applauding when the plane touches the ground. Being Israeli means arguing what is the best hummus, the best place to shop online, or how a ripe watermelon sounds. It means saying what you want, when you want to, and fighting for the right of those who you disagree with to say complete nonsense. It's coming out from a synagogue and hearing the call to prayer from a nearby mosque. It's volunteering, sharing, and helping those in need wherever you are in the world. And always coming together in times of joy, but also in times of tragedy. Being an Israeli means respecting your past as you look towards the future, and knowing that togetherness will help us overcome any kind of obstacle. Being Israeli means being free to be yourself.